Okay, first of all, let me preface everything I'm about to say by saying, yes, I do read Undead Unluck, the manga. Um, I'm not caught up with the current four chapters because I don't read manga week to week. I binge it every four to six weeks. So I have to catch up on these most recent chapters. But that being said, we will I will not be dropping any spoilers in this. So anime only, Spawn Dead, Unluck, you are more than welcome. And anybody else who reads the manga, keep the spoilers out of the comment section. We're only discussing episode two and what we've seen so far. Y'all, I'm not even gonna lie. Getting images for Undead Unluck, not images, but getting a uh, video like clips is hard because andy really do be naked almost the whole fucking episode and just cheeks be everywhere <laughs> so bear with me if I, you don't have as many if with the undead unluck content you don't get as much like like scenes like animated scenes because it's real hard editing that shit um number one though i'm gonna have to go ahead and say for accuracy within the manga, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. The only things they left out, which were not important, was Fuko hitching that ride over to the demolition site and the demolition guys uh, blowing up the building while Andy and them was inside of the building and like chanting like no unrealistic schedules or whatever. So again, nothing really big that I would even complain about. Other than that, David, David Productions was on it, okay? So we got to meet Shen, y'all. And y'all, Shen's such a fun guy. And he was so perfect. He's everything I thought he was in my mind reading the manga. He's adorable. He's precious. I love Shen. His personality is just, it's so great. And I just enjoyed the whole concept behind that. You get to learn more about the Union, which those original guys that attacked them in episode one was part of the Union. So you get to learn more about the Union and pretty much how the Union sees anyone who's not a part of the 10 of the round table as Umas. And Umas are things that affect the order of the world. You see what I'm saying? So you also get to learn a good bit more about the power system because I've raved about this power system since I started reading Undead Unluck. It's such a great power system. It's easy to follow, but it's so fun and unique. Because again, as you witness in episode two, how you understand your power and the rules of your power are crucial to how you fight with it or how you end up losing. As we witness with Andy using his, uh, his finger bullet to fucking end unavoidable and it's gonna you're gonna continue to learn more about the power system as the series goes on but that's a good little starter right also can we talk about the moment with fuko when andy is like all right after he unalives unavoidable and then he's and they're like okay well there's a spot for one of y'all and he's like go on fuko because at the end of the day the thing about Andy is he is a good guy. He is a gentleman, whether you believe it or not. And the, at the end of the day, Andy's like, you go with them. You take a seat because at the end of the day, I'm undead. I'm going to be fine. And I'm, I, I will find you. Trust. I will find you. Um, but you could not handle being captured. And I'm not going to let that happen. I'll get out and I'll find you. Trust me. And the fact is why we love Shin. Shin was like, mm, you know what? Y'all are too cute. It would be a crime to separate y'all. Tell you what, go try it with somebody else. See if you could beat one of the other members of the round table of the union. Not me, but if you do beat them, I'll put in a good word for you and y'all both can join. And again, that's just why I love Shin. Like he's so self-serving in a lot of ways and you will find out more about that and him as you keep going. But he's such a good guy also, such a great guy. So now Fuko and Andy are on their way to Russia and, uh, it's finna be good. It's finna be good. So, all in all, good episode. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Very excited for next week's episode. The, the fights in next week's episode, it's finna be good. The story is finna be good. So, just stay tuned because, baby, I'm gonna be doing this, these recaps for Undead Unluck all season.